Hello and welcome back to another review with me, Overdose Vapes, and my fiance, Vanna Vapes. That's Hi. right. I put a ring on it. He put a ring on it. Put a ring on it. <laughs> I don't know the song or I would have sing it. The whole song. Then we'll get copyright strikes. Um, so. No, because I sang it. It'd be too close. She's, she's good. Thoughts. It is a flower, so if you guys can't see it, I will put up close pictures for you guys. Because, you know. The ring is called You know Panda. So uh, today we're looking at something that was sent out by our good friends over at Trinity Glass Hardware, and this is the US-1 Mechanical Mod and the US-1 V2 RDA. And we, they sent us a whole bunch of range of different tops, and they're starting to do tops that fit multiple RDAs, um, which I kind of wish they set stuck stayed where they were, where they had tops for d different ones. They've always done that. They've always had tops that'll fit different I don't ideas. know, but yeah, I don't know. I thought they'd add to, because usually you pick your top, whatever. But yeah, they all fit perfectly. The only one we had a problem one with was the goon, but they said that they're trying to figure out the goon. Um, they're having problems with um, the whole building the glass around the goon and and really only the specifically the, the one rings. and it's the one goon top right no they're having problems with the goon uh, period they're um well yeah I think it's the the the, Cause the bullet competition ones that we have seem to fit fine yeah and they sent sent you o rings with it but they were too chunky it was for what is this called the kind of competition ones competition yep. The competition one, that's the one that's having a, they're having problems with. Um, either it's, it's too big for the original O-rings. So or, it slips right off. Or it's too, um, sm the O-rings they give you are too chunky. So what I found is if you have the drop, the drops O-rings fit. You put the drops of rings on it, and it makes it fit. It fits perfectly. Um, I accidentally, <laughs> I had a, what was this, my third one? Second one. Second one, a champion for my goon, and I broke it. <laughs> I broke the first one. She broke the second yeah, one. Yeah, so now we're with the bullet. <laughs> it's just for some reason did not want to have that cap on it. <laughs> Our goon is cursed with those regular cap it, It's goons. like it just wants its, its original cap back. That's what it wants. It wants to wear its, it wants to wear its but original hat. All the other ones, I've never broke one. It just seems like the goon, maybe the goon is just. I ha I do have goon food in it, so maybe it's heavy on it's one heavy side. Heavy on one side, yeah. Because that goon food is. If you don't know it, go check out um, Yeti Wire, and it's always Black Friday, and Goon Food is humongous. That is a big coil. It's like, a big fat coil. Sheesh. And the, you know, the, and the Goon RDA is heavy, and it just, um, I could see there are a lot of reasons why it would be top heavy. So, but anyways, I mean, that's the one problem that we've had with these but things. But besides that, they're beautiful. Besides that, everything else has been really great. And and honestly, the reason we wanted to do this video was mostly to talk about the mod. Because the mod they sent is just... Everyone knows about the caps. Yeah. And we've talked about the caps at length before, but this mod, as I don't think it gets enough attention, because this it is absolutely... This isn't the newer new. mod, right? This is the newest... This is their mod. Yeah. Oh, this is the... And they're in their newest version of their RDA as well. And I think it just doesn't get enough attention, and so we kind of wanted to talk about it, because it's fucking nice. Can I say something? Yeah. Like... You know me with my problem with my hands, with buttons. I'm always having issues with buttons where I have to actually like unscrew them, obviously because I have nails, and because the, my fingers issues, like I can't have them too rough or anything. That button is like perfect. It's not too like loose. It's not. It's a perfect like what's it called? Throw. Throw. And I can use it, I can use like, let me show, like even with my nails, like I have no problem. It's perfect. And it's flat on there. Ew, I just got juice on. I know, I just juiced it. <laughs> um, it's flat on there. It's so well put together and it feels so good in your hand. The mat is, oh my God. Ew, that's it. That's that. You have that in there? Mm -hmm. It tastes like soap. <laughs> So, if you ever had this stuff, I don't know what it is with my taste buds, but I get like a soapy, soapy taste from it. It is the don't I love donuts too, not the 
original one, the two, I get straight soap. Like this. It's not the best this, flavor. This one, like soap that you use for your dishes. But yeah, um, the button on this thing is it sits flush. I've never had to tighten it it's or anything. Amazing. I've never had to mess with it. The mod actually comes apart in the middle. And we'll show you guys up close stuff. Um, it has. I didn't even know that. It comes with part in the middle instead of the bottom. So I've never had any problems like with the um, the button becoming loose. It sits flush and the throw is very short. Not so short that it's like the uh, like the broadside, but it you, it doesn't it's get just stuck. Perfect. It's just perfect. It doesn't perfect. get stuck. You don't have feel like it's it's not like the broadside where you know you hit it on both like sides and it feels like it might get stuck or like you know, something like after you use it for a while. It's just like I don't even know how to explain it. It's just you. you it's push a couple it, millimeters deep. It's the it's best button feel, I ever used, ever. It's enough that you feel like you're pushing something, but it doesn't give. It's not a lot of resistance. It's just a really well designed button. That's it's my favorite part about the whole. Sturdy. It's a very sturdy button. Like it not. It doesn't feel like after like a, a year of using it, it's going to start getting like chunky or like like um, stuck or anything. It feels the same now as the first day we got it. And we've had it for a few, we've had it for a couple weeks and. We've been using it. I used it for a couple. I used it for like a week straight. Penny used it for like a week straight. Go. Um, every day. So I see you dropped it. Um, the only complaint I have is because, and this is a just my OCD. Um, the cats don't fit, like, like on like. It's not it? flush. Flushed. There is a lip going on. How about and with one it, of these ones? Let's try with one of those ones. I'm scared. There's like, several. Let me see. I'm scared to lift that cap. There's several there's caps. So much juice in there. There's several caps that go with this RDA. Nope. No, none of the caps. Um, Still 100 percent flush. I, I, maybe they did that on purpose. I'm pretty sure they probably did. There's maybe a reason for it. I don't know what the reason would be, but I, it, for me, my OCD, it, it bugs the heck out of me. But it's something that I've learned to just ignore. <laughs> maybe one of these like bullet caps on. Yeah, maybe. Oh, maybe so you can use your glass cap on and it'll fit good. Because that fits perfect. Perfect. Like, but the besides bulge. the bulge, but like the little gap. But that's there's always a gap with the caps. Um, maybe that's why. So you can have your, your glass, you can have the option of the glass cap, a whole glass cap, and it'll fit. That makes sense. It looks really good like that. Um, but I love this one like <clears throat> there's half metal half glass ones that they these are with. beautiful they're, they're really great yeah i love the fact that it's a combination of like the sturdiness of the of the metal at the bottom we still get that nice glass feel with your on your lips from the I top love, i love that rda too it's so easy to build on it is amazing to build on my only complaint about it and this is my complaint anytime anybody uses grub screws is that it has grub screws on the top instead of like phillips head or flathead screws. or having the option of having a bag with does it come with screws? It comes with extras, but not like not 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 flatheads or. Well, I I another thing I like is with both sets the um the the rose gold and the black, the screws match. So the black art um caps come with black screws, which I thought was really cool. Nice. And the rose go rose gold comes with the ro rose gold um screws screws. So, like, replacement screws. So, they match. And I think that's very nice to have. Like, I like to have matching screws. <laughs> I just, they sent us, they sent us not, so they sent us the black mod, which is the one they had in stock. And they sent us the black cap that matches it. And then the black glass and metal one. So, there's, like, a full metal cap you can get. that It takes an 810 drip tip. This is my favorite one. I like it. It just feels more sturdy. Um, and then there's some, like obviously the, the glass and the metal one, and then they also sent us the rose gold one because that's another color that you can get this mod in. It's just he's had most use of it. I've only tested it out for a few days because I didn't get one, but that's okay. Can't be greedy. But I did test it out for a few days, and I just I I really like the button. The button is important to me. The most important part of the thing because that's what makes you know makes it work. And if it feels like it's going to be like start getting all like falling apart on you, like hello, what's up? We've had a lot of problems with buttons on mods. And or it's going to start sticking where you auto fire and stuff like that. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> um, 
then that that's what I don't like. But with that, you do not, you can actually feel that it's never going to have that kind of issue at all. It's just not going to have it just issue. It just has such a good feel to the button. It's in the <clears throat> Inside comes with these little plastic sleeves for your batteries. Which I really like. Uh, which I think is great. So it's just to prevent any kind of shorting. It's kind of like the broadside. Yeah. But you have the option of taking them out if you want the. I don't know why you would, but you can definitely do that. I mean, do you get a better connection no, with them out? No, definitely not. No, yeah, just... yeah, because you can't. We thought maybe you can put a bigger battery in there, and no. No. It's just for battery safety. But I think you can take them out so you can clean it. Definitely. Yeah, I like, the, I like that they are removable so you can get in there and really clean this whole thing out. It's made out of copper. This is just black coated copper, um, so it hits hard as F. It really does hit hard. Yeah, like where you, you dropped it. It's like. I didn't drop it. I don't know how that happened. Well, it matches the caps. <laughs> the yeah. cap. So I guess if you took off that black, if you wanted to take it off, like sand it down, it would be it would match. the, the um, rose, rose gold. Or copper. However you want to say it. Um, it does, they do list it as rose gold, but it's copper. Um, so yeah, and you can get this modding copper, and you can also get it in stainless steel. Um, I like the black one a lot, except for, um, you know... I, I love the black one. I, would, I just like black I would mods. prefer the copper one, because I just like copper mods. Um, but this one is, you know, made from copper, so you still get that. But this one is made out of copper, so you do get that hard-hitting copper feel that you would get from a regular copper mod. Um, it's just black. And, and it does look really stealthy. And it is a really nice looking mod. I think it's one of the nicer mod, nicer looking mods that we have. It's and just it stands sleek. very well. It stands sturdy. Yeah. It doesn't wobble in any way because how well on here because it's on a mat. Yeah. But um, because of how the button is so flush and so like nicely put together, it doesn't like some of these just like just wobble. <laughs> Everything sticks to this. <laughs> I have like metal everywhere all over this. The um. What is this one? McLovin. McLovin. And it's got a nice venting um, hole on the top to go off to the yeah, sides. Yeah, we were wondering how the batteries went, and then we looked, and we were like, wow. Yeah, um, instead of, like, most most mod, like, tube mods either have it coming out of the bottom or out the top, like, straight out the top. They have it coming out of the side, so if something did happen, it's not going to hit your face. Or burn your hand. Or burn, yeah, or it's gonna, burn your it's hand. It's going to shoot out to the sides, which I think is such a great idea. So yes. I always line up, and it kind of just naturally lines up the airflow holes, kind of line up with those uh, vent holes, so that, you know, when you're holding it, those vent holes are always pointed away from mm -hmm. you. I think that's genius. You just can genius. definitely tell they put a lot of thought into it, putting it together, and they did a very, really good job. I, I actually really really like it i love the, i love the curves of it it's really subtle and you can't really tell with the black it's on camera it's kind of like the um it's a little bit like the dreamer you have with the curves or like the 1111 if you guys are familiar with that we don't have one here but it's, it's a little similar to that it has this really nice little kind of feminine curve to i it. didn't even know it had a curve like you don't even feel it the curve no and i you know it looks really great i think it looks that honestly looks at its best, obviously, with the RDA that it's intended to go with, which is this US-1. Um, but it looks great with other RDAs on there as well. Um, I've used, like, uh, stuff from Dot .mod on here with the glass caps. It looks great. Um, but to me, it always just like, feels best. If there's, if you don't want it to 510, you can put a regular um, A10 drip tip on it. Yep. I mean, it doesn't match completely, obviously, but I'm sure you can find a drip tip they online. Did, they did send us a drip tip for the black one, which is this glass it's, drip it's tip with, with the black. No, it's eight ten. It is eight ten. Yeah. it looks five ten. No, it's eight ten. Oh. No, it's eight ten, and it goes. Uh, this one matches the the black one. Obviously, it has little black uh, O rings on the bottom of it. But I think you can also get those in rose gold. So. Yeah, I'm not sure. It does. I mean, I tried it on the ro rose gold one. I have a problem. My accent doesn't want me to say ro rose. Rose, rose gold, rose gold, rose. and it does. I mean, you could get away with it, but it, it doesn't really match that well. No, I mean this one's for the black one. I think. Like, yeah. Hundred percent. And then, you know, when you have it all blacked out like this, it I think it looks really, nice. really, really nice. Yeah. So, um, and you know, for the price, I think it's really How it's, much is it's it? about one hundred fifty dollars. So it's about typical for what you're gonna pay for what is I would that call. With the RDA? High -end. No, that's just for the mod. But I mean, um, you're talking. Another forty, I think it, the RDA itself is not really expensive. It's about between forty and fifty dollars. So you're talking about two hundred dollars for the whole setup, which I think is about typical for what this mod is, which is definitely a high I think end. It mod. is worth 
what the price point Definitely. is because it is so put together and yeah. it's so comfortable to use and you don't have to have any thought when you're using it like you don't have to like oh i have to hit the button a certain way or i have to hold it like, nothing you just vape enjoy and that's it. it to me it's everything from like a showpiece mod something you can show off because it is so attractive yet it's still a workhorse like i can take this with me everywhere i know it's going to perform I know the button's going to work every time I hit it, and I, it's just a fantastic mod. I, I can't say enough nice things about no. this mod. This is the kind of mod I would personally buy myself. If they hadn't sent it to us, which they did, full disclosure, they did send, it to us, send this to us for free for this review. Thank you, Trinity. Yep, but this was something that I would definitely buy, and it's something that I could definitely see us buying more of. So. Yes. I mean, the, I love everything. The only con I would have is suggestive is the lip. Which, yeah, and that's going to drive some people crazy, um, like our boy Yeti, that little tiny lip. Uh, to me, I didn't even notice it until she pointed it out, but to somebody who's like OCD like, like that me. about their about their RDAs, um, that's going to drive them fucking crazy. But it obviously, when you put the glass cap on it, it made sense why they did that. They want so you can put the glass cap and you don't even have a lip no more. Like if you're using if another RDA, like if you're using another RDA with one of their glass caps, you're going to have no lip. It's going to be 100% yeah. on there. So I think that is the purpose of the lip, but if you're using their RDA with it and you're like me, it's going to get, I mean, it took me a bit to go override that look and say, it's okay. I Everything's honestly, okay, Panda. <laughs> I honestly didn't even notice it until you pointed out. It vapes so good that I, I can overlook that. It's, I kind of like it. I'm so, I'm so weird. I like things that aren't 100% flush. I'm a weirdo. He's a weirdo. I like 22 millimeter mods. I like 22 millimeter RDAs on 25 millimeter mods. I'm a weirdo. <laughs> He'll use a tank on a freaking on, on a tube mod if it's a hybrid. <laughs> I will. 100. I love tube mods. So um yeah so for me um Panda doesn't really score the same way that I do but for me this is as about as good as it gets. So I would give it something like a 4.8 out of five. I think it's absolutely top notch. I think it's 100 percent what I look for in a Mac mod. I get it. Straight thumbs up. That's how I score. You know me. If you know my channel, I usually go thumbs down or thumbs up. And it's definitely thumbs up all the way. I love it. I definitely would love to go. If I had the money for one, I would definitely go purchase one. It's it's worth it. I mean, even if you can only afford the mod itself, that is fine. You can get their glass caps. For your RDA, for and it'll any look of your perfect. RDAs, it'll yeah. look perfectly like it belonged. And also, I mean, you know, and okay. So for the mod, I'd say four point out of five. For the RDA, and I kind of think of them as one thing because I've been using them as one thing. Yeah, me too. But if I separate the RDA, <clears throat> it's also top notch. The materials are are of a super high quality. Um, you can stick any build in here. Right now, we have this crazy ass build in here. It's like a triple parallel with Clapton's. He's and like the wire. greatest build in there. I I vape. Like, he cleaned it out for me, and I put my juice in there, and I baked it out, and it was just the nicest build. It's got that warm vape, and it's just really good. I think anything else would probably wouldn't give it much flavor in that. It's a pretty big open deck. Um, you got to fill it up with wire, and this is a big this is a big coil. But like I said, it's like a triple parallel, so it's a pretty low ohm build. And that's what I recommend for this would be like a low ohm, larger build. Something like Aliens would be good in here. Uh, but you want to fill up that space, like it, it, with any RDA. I think you really want to fill up any kind of dead space inside yeah. of it. Uh, but I love the way that the airflow works. It's simple. Um, it's 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 really easy to build on. I would give this a 4.5 out of 5. I think it's it's a totally excellent RDA. And in and of itself, I think it's worth buying. Even if you didn't want to buy the mod or you couldn't afford to buy the mod, this is an RDA worth having. Yes. Absolutely. I like the RDA. And I love the, I love the look of it. I love it with these this cap. It's just so sexy to me. Let me see. It is really nice with these glass, these metal on glass caps. It look really good. I just like the black on the glass. Is I think it, especially the matte black. Even I mean I even like this. This is it's just sexy. The metal with yep. glass. It's just a very sexy like. To me, the only thing yeah. I dislike about it is the little bit of the. It's, it doesn't match the shape as well as just the straight metal ones. Cause it kind of bubbles with the glass which is unavoidable because that's just how glass is um but see i i'm a little bit less enthused by this look than just the straight metal look because it looks radically different yeah it's more of like a bubbly kind of girly shape with that that's glass. something that i just doesn't bother me i just really like 
I I I, I just like these kind of caps. Period. Yeah. Like. I just have a thing with these caps, and, and it actually I'm shortens it. Them. It shortens the the actual uh, the height of the yeah, mod by does. quite a bit. So yeah, depending on what you want, I think that you know they, they give you every option that you can imagine. Um, know. I'm pretty sure the caps come both. Um, when you buy, I just dropped everything. When you buy the caps, you get both yeah, options definitely. in there. So yep. you get the the solid black, and you get the glass in in them together. Yeah. So you get two caps for one. Yep. Yeah. When we got so we got the RDA was in the black uh, box, but then when we bought when they sent the separate rose gold ones, it had one of each cap. Yeah, I thought that they sent two RDAs. I was like, oh, cool. But these were just the caps. But it's still awesome that they give you two caps. Yep. Like two separate different styles for. Just the price that I don't know how much the RDA. I, I'm not 100 percent sure how I, I'm, the RDA itself. I'm pretty sure is around between 40 and 50. I'm not sure how much the just the caps are because yeah. you can just buy just the caps as well to go on. Your, but they're your they've usually been really affordable with their caps that I've seen. Like yeah, the glass caps range anywhere between like and 20 made, and 25. And they're made very well, yep. so I mean I can get I can pretty much guarantee there's a lot of work that goes into these caps, yep. so. I appreciate every penny that I spend with them because it's they're putting a lot of work into what they do. I think they're a really good price to performance value. Yeah. Absolutely. Okay, well, um, thank you guys so much for joining us. Thank you so much to Trinity Glass for sending us out so we could take a look at it. Thank you, Trinity. And we are absolutely in love with this mod, and we can't wait to get more Trinity Glass hardware products in the future so we can share them with you guys. Yes, definitely uh, excited. Yes. All right, we'll see you guys next time. Peace Bye. out.